What's up internet? My name is JT and welcome back to my channel. And for today's video, I'll be teaching you guys another song to play in the uke. So without further talk, grab your ukulele because today I'm gonna teach you how to play Take Her to the Moon for Me by Moira de la Torre. So for our tutorial today, I'll be using a capo and I already clip it on the second fret of my uke. And for those viewers na walang capo and yung mga viewers din na nagtatanong sa akin kung pwede ba yung tugtugin na walang capo kasi usually yung mga recent tutorials ko gumagamit ako ng capo. So, ayun. The answer is yes, pwede naman na walang capo but the only thing is that medyo mababa yung pitch kasi the purpose of using a capo is pang pa-transpose siya ng pitch. Ibig sabihin, kung hindi mo abot yung pitch, kailangan mo mag-adjust. So, you have to use a capo para bumagay yung kanta sa boses mo. So, yun na. So, for the intro part, the chord progression is D, G, B minor 7, G, and A. And ilalagay ko na lang yung chord uh, illustrations dito somewhere here. So, ayun, para di na ako mag-explain para sa finger placement. Just have to follow the illustrations and you're good to go. And also, follow the um, what did I call this one? The blocking pattern na ilalagay ko dyan. And also, check out the pinned comment section below for the chords plus the lyrics of this song para masundan nyo yung tutorial na to. So, ayun. <clears throat> Medyo mababa na yung boses ko kasi it's 10, 25 p.m. And, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, for the... Sinabi ko na ba? Ayun na. <laughs> yung chord progression for the intro is D, G, B minor 7, G, and A. So, first thing that you have to do is that you have to position your fingers here in your fretboard according to the chord progression. So, first chord is D. Ayan. Tapos, strum natin siya. ba? So, yung nakalagay naman sa blocking pattern natin is first thing is strum. Well, there are two types of strumming. The first type of strumming is using your fingernail. So, this is the typical strumming. Ayan. So, gamit yung kuko. Kung wala kang pick kuko, ba? So, ayun. And the second type of, str of strumming is using your thumb. So, yung gagamitan natin is the second type of strumming, which is using your thumb. So, ayun. So, position mo, D, tapos strum. Ayan. Tapos, after nun, is you have to pluck first string. Well, by the way, this is the fourth string. Yung, ayan, yung facing dito sa baba mo, eto yung four. Eto yung three, two, and yung string na facing sa ground, yun yung first string. 1, 2, 3, 4, 4, 3, 2, 1. So, ayun. So, ulit. Ulitin natin. Strum, tapos block, 1, tapos 4, 2, 4, 1, and 4. So, so, magiging ganun siya. Then, every time na nagsa-strum ka, ibig sabihin, lumilipat ka ng chord. So, strum, 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. Tapos, strum, so, kita nyo yun? So, from first chord to second chord. Tapos, pag lumipat na ako, strum ka na. Okay? Strum, 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. Strum, 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. Strum, 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. So, nasa B minor 7 na tayo. Tapos, after nun, is G. Tapos, balik tayo sa G. But, after the second G, ba may dalawang G sa chord progression natin. Yung pangalawang G, strum. Tapos, 1 and 4 lang yung ipapluck natin. Strum, 1, 4. Tapos, after nun, is A. So, strum, A. Tapos, balik ka na sa original na Blocking pattern. Strum. 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. So, ayun. So, itry natin na tugtugin yung intro. Okay? So, 
So, ayun. That is for our intro na part. So, sana naintindihan nyo yun and na-gets nyo. Madali lang naman siya kasi paulit-ulit lang naman yung plucking pattern natin. And, uh, the plucking pattern na inintroduce ko sa intro, ganun na din yung para sa verse 1 and also for the chorus. So, ayun. So, let's move on sa verse 1. The chord progression para sa verse 1 is, aray, <laughs> D, G, A, G, D, G, C, and A. So, ayun. Same strumming, ay, plucking pattern. At aga. No matter what I do, I... So, diba, after nun is, strum 1, 4, 2, 4, 1, 4. Tapos, no matter what I do. Sa do, magsa-strum ka. Isang strum lang. Okay, so gan magiging ganto siya. No matter what I do, I still feel you coming. Tapos, switch. Back to me. When I know that you never will. So before I say goodbye. So, naalala nyo yung sa no matter what I do, diba dun, after sa fourth string, magsa-strum ka ng one sa do. So, same thing dito sa, so before I say goodbye, would you do one last thing for me? Okay? Be, be happy. Pause na ako. Gabi na. <laughs> A. And so, ayun na yung sa verse 1. So, ulitin natin. <laughs> no matter what I do, I still feel you coming back to me. When I know that you So before I say goodbye, would you do one last thing for me? Be happy and take. So, ayan. So let's move on sa chorus na part. So, para sa chorus, after nung first chorus, ulitin nyo lang siya. So, bale, twice yung chorus natin. And, ay, teka. <laughs> By the way, the chord progression for the chorus is D, G, B minor 7, G, A, D, G, B minor 7, E minor 7, G, A, and D. And also, the plucking pattern is the same. So, ayun. So, be happy and say So, bali dito sa first line, take, take her to the moon for me. So, twice nyo siyang gawin, yung plucking pattern. So, take, take her to the moon for, tapos saka ka na magsiswitch, for me. Someday I know I'm 
kadali. Madali siya para sa akin. Ewan ko sa inyo. Pero, Or ayun stos. lang. <laughs> so, ayun lang. Si-share ko lang kung paano ko tinugtog yung nasa cover ko. Kasi, parang ang pangit naman kasi pag sa st- strumming yung gamit to. Kasi, ang mellow kasi nung kanta. So, parang dapat, parang lulabay yung lalabay. Lalabay. Okay? <laughs> lalabay yung ano tawag dito yung pagkatugtog. So, that's it for our tutorial today, guys. I hope na nagustuhan niyo yung tutorial na to. And if you want more tutorials like this, just click the subscribe button down below. And if you want to be notified sa mga bagong uploads ko and live stream, just click the bell button beside the subscribe button down below. And if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. <laughs> and kung may mga comments kayo tungkol dito, dito, okay, ano ba yun? <laughs> tungkol dito, and suggestions for my next covers and tutorials and also questions regarding this tutorial just drop it down on the comment section below so i'll see you guys on my next videos and, and don't forget your fmp <laughs> and thanks for watching Bye. that you will hope baliw na shout out na talaga bye